Hi guys, introducing the 300 series flare kits from OTA, Overland Tours Australia. We're really proud of these and uh, I'm going to walk you through and tell you a few things of the design, uh, some key features and why they're a good addition to your new 300. So the first time I saw a new 300 series, I looked at it and went, uh, anyone that's going to put a, a plus size tyre or a bigger wheel on that car, they're going to stick out pretty bad. So that's what got us on the path of um, designing and manufacturing these flares. That's where the idea was born and away we went. So it's taken us 12 months to get these right. 35 mil wide from the factory and some real key points that we wanted to see was that it looked nearly that Toyota made them and we didn't want them to stick out like a big bolt on flare. So we're quite proud of our design and we think it fits the purpose really well. Furthermore to our design, we went one step again and we designed a new mud flap to suit the flare so that we get full coverage, no stone, mud, rock can get past it. So yeah, we thought that was really warranted with the flare and the vehicle. Like they're an expensive car, they're a good looking car and we wanted to make a good looking product. So just a little bit more information on the mud flaps. They've been designed to um, go straight back into the factory fitting points of the OE mud flap. And a bit, a bit further information for those out there that are looking at doing uh, J-Max uh, three inch lift with GVM upgrades. We work pretty closely with the guys over there and uh, come up with a de new design for a mud flap to suit the 35 and the three inch lift. So been tested, tried, it's on their cars, working well. So. Uh, we do have, it looks the same from the exterior, a couple of design changes on the interior, but still meets the flare and looks really great. So about the design, the actual fitment and the no stick on and no drills type thing was of big interest to us. So as you can see, our flares pick up on the factory mounting points. So a part of that is you remove the factory fitting hardware and reuse it in pretty well all of the uh, attachment points. So that's another great plus design for us, reuse factory fitment points. We do have a little bit of drilling, I'll show you that on the rear flares, two drills and a mud flap drill, but very, very simple, very straightforward and very uh, non-intrusive. So on the GR Sport here, we've got uh, Monster Rim and it's a POS 20. So that means it's um, actually wider than the factory wheel. And on a 285, 65, 18 tyre, so that's like a plus, what we would call a plus one fitment, which is probably a real common size that the, the customers might may put on their vehicle. So as you can see, our flare, which is 35 mil from the body, so it can handle a, a, a 35 mil um, increase in tyre width. But just check your legalities on the actual tyre width that you put on your vehicle. The OTA flares quite comfortably cover that wheel, so it does keep you legal. Once again, our rear mud flap matches the flare, guards the vehicle from stone chips, keeps the people um, behind you protected, stops mud, sand, grit flying up the side of your car. So the ODA flare, it's manufactured from ABS plastic. And by the way, those materials are fully recycled. So uh, we're trying to work with the environment as best we can, but provide a tough, durable product. And then the mud flaps are made from a PE material. So no color coding required from that. And actually the material is nearly an exact match with the OE. By the way, the ABS flares are UV resistant, but they come in a black, but uncolor coded and our suggestion is you do color code them and paint them. These ones have been painted. So on the OTA Land Cruiser we ran with, initially we bought a POS 35 rim, it's actually a Ford Ranger rim, and ran the 28, we've got the 285 65 18 on here. So it's actually uh, 15 mil wider than the offset on the GR Sport. And as you can see the flare still well and truly covers it nicely and uh, protects the vehicle. In, in testing, we were running uh, 35, 12 and a half, 18 rim, and the vehicle was still legal at that offset and tyre size. So as I mentioned a bit earlier, uh, the fitment of the flare is quite straightforward. So on the front flare and the front mud flap, there's actually no drilling. Factory points, they remount to those. So the only drilling required is on the rear flares and the rear mud flap. There's one drill screw back there, but when we're fitting this flare, it picks up all the other factory points. And just for extra security, we've got these, these two screws here, which just a small three mil drill bit, and you're away. So that's really quite easy. The other drill point is at the rear mud flap, just on the inside, just mark the hole, put a drill through, put your set screw in. So really straightforward, can be installed at home if you've got the tools. Actually a wonderful product, we're really proud of it. Head over to our website, with the store there, you can get some further information and some pricing on them. And uh, we really look forward to seeing these on your car.